Hey everyone, it's Brittany and I am back again with another Nordstrom anniversary sale recommendation video. This time around, I will be covering all the boots and shoes and we have over 20 items that I will be speaking about. I have my laptop here ready to go with all the images pulled up and I will be doing screenshots off to the side so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But before we get into this, if you haven't seen my Nordstrom video about coats and jackets, go ahead and pause this, go check out that video or watch it after you watch this. And of course, subscribe, like this video if you wanna see more Nordstrom anniversary videos. I have so many in the making that I want to do. So let me know if you guys have any ideas for anything that you wanna see with the sale. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I am blush underscore Brittany over there if you wanna see a little peek into my day-to-day -day life. So kicking off this series about the Nordstrom anniversary sale, I had to do my first video, coats and jackets, because that's the one category that I love. The second category has to be shoes and booties, and particularly booties and knee-high boots. Those are my favorite, as you can see. Yeah, I love, I love knee-high boots. Now, I'll also have all of these linked down below in the description box so you can go right to it and shop directly from it. It is affiliate link, so it does help support my channel. I'm a little baby channel and I am working on growing and being more consistent with my content. So it really helps me out if you do click those links. All right, enough blabbering, let's get into these boots. So I'm gonna start off with knee high boots. This category is probably the hardest for me because there's quite a few that I really like. So I'm gonna give you my recommendations and then also my wish list. So starting out, the first boot that we're gonna talk about, let me pull it up here on my laptop, is this Sam Edelman, I believe it's called Ollie Knee High Boot. You guys, this boot is so gorgeous. So first off, you have four different um, colors of the boot. We have an eggshell, which is number one on my, my wish list. I've been looking for a knee high boot that was like a leather material and this really pretty cream color because I do tend to have a light and airy wardrobe. So I know that this would go with a lot of pieces that I already have. And yeah, I'm, I'm super excited about this one. And then the next color is this dusty blue. They're calling it river rock. This is a beautiful suede material. I feel like this boot would actually go really well with this off the shoulder dress that I'm wearing right now. Super cute. I just, I love this color. One other thing I wanna point out about these boots is the shape of them. The toe has a really beautiful point and it's, well, not a point, it's a square toe, but it slenders out to the right width where it doesn't look like a wonky square toe. You know what I mean? It's like a beautiful, sleek square toe, if that makes sense. You can also get this in your classic black. So if you need a black knee-high boot, this one is super gorgeous. I would highly recommend it. I talked a little bit in my coats and jacket video about Sam Edelman and how much I love this brand. And then there's this really pretty color. It's called Sesame. It's like a light gray. So if you tend to have like a color palette of clothes where you wear a lot of grays or cool tone colors, this light gray would be beautiful to add your wardrobe. I just have to say, I personally would love all four pairs of this boot, but to be realistic, I, I, I'm going to get the eggshell and then I'm kind of at a loss between the blue and the gray. I don't know which one to get. Which one are you guys getting? Fill me in so I can figure that out. Let me know in the comments what boot you're picking up from the sale, if any. Okay, next up we have this Vince Camuto um, knee-high boot. And I like this one because it is sort of like a Western style. Um, it has kind of like that cowboy boot um, look to it, especially at the top of the boot. Again, this is that square toe, which is super on trend this season. And I saw a little bit of it last year with Sam Edelman. They had a boot that, that was square toe. Again, this one is a beautiful shape. I like that it does come in your classic sort of tan taupe shade. I'm gonna be picking mine up in this sable color, 
which is a really rich deep brown. I do not have a boot this color and I feel like this is a boot that I could definitely incorporate with my wardrobe and I'm really excited about it. The other shade that is super pretty too that I like is the light cognac. And this is a leather material. It kind of reminds me of like a riding boot in a sense too. What I love about getting these boots is that you can have it in a few staple colors that you can rotate throughout your wardrobe. I just love this boot. It's, it's sexy, it's gorgeous. And if you need a knee high boot, I would definitely recommend either the Sam Edelman one or the Spence Camuto. Those are my top two picks for the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I personally feel like they're gonna be sold out items. So if you like a shade, definitely get your hands on it and that way you don't have to worry about it. Okay, next up is this Treasure and Bond knee high boot. Now I've never tried this brand before, um, but the quality looks really nice. This boot is super simple in the structure of it. I like it, I feel like it looks super clean. I love that the stitching goes all the way up and you can kind of see the details on that. Yeah, this one looks really nice. It is more of a pointed toe, but not super pointy. So this could definitely be casual, um, especially with the heel being more of a lighter kind of tan color, super casual boot. I mean, this one looks really great too, a hundred bucks. You can't beat it. Now this next knee high boot is from the Lucky brand. I like this one, again, it's similar to the Treasure and Bond one with the super simple design, but in the front portion of the boot, it does kind of have more of like a Western feel with the stitching um, right at the ankle. I do like that the heel is a little bit darker. So in my opinion, it kind of looks a little bit more dressy. You get three shades to choose from. They're all um, a suede material, just gorgeous. I mean, it's gonna be really hard this year to choose which knee-high boot you wanna go with. So I'm sorry, but there's a lot of really good options. And I would say if you are if you haven't tried a knee-high boot, I would highly recommend at least picking up one pair, maybe in the black or the tan, of whatever you know shade that you're gonna wear more often, and just give it a try. I did that last year with the tan, and I ended up wearing it all the time. I just discovered my love for knee-high boots. The last knee-high boot that I'm gonna speak about is the Creme de la Creme, the Stuart Weitzman. Now, this one is a pretty penny, but I will tell you, if you wear knee-high boots all the time, well, actually this is an over, is it knee-high? Yeah, they're calling it knee-high, but I guess based on your height, it could be over the knee too. Either way, I love this boot because it literally stays up. It does not fall down. You can see in the back of this boot that you can tie it to really keep it secured on your leg. Now, I have tried cheaper brands, and again, no matter how tight I tie the ties, it will come down. With the Stuart Weitzman, that's why you're paying for the quality of the shoe. It does not come down. So I invested in two pairs of over-the-knee boots last year from Stuart Weitzman, and I do not regret it at all. I love them, and I take care of them. They're my baby. Okay, let's dive into the booties category. Now, this first pair of booties, I am predicting will sell out super fast. It is the Mark Fisher, um, what are they called? The pointed toe booties. You guys, this one comes in five shades. You have a mixture of um, leather options and suede options. And this is just the classic timeless pointy toed booty I have a pair from last year and they are so comfortable. I could walk around all day and all night and my feet do not hurt. I love the sleek design of these booties. They come to a beautiful point. Um, so you can either dress it up or you can dress them down. Now the color that I'm interested in is the gray suede. This color is so gorgeous. It is, in my opinion, it looks like a dusty blue color. Do you guys see that? I don't know why, why it's called gray, but I love this blue shade. It's so gorgeous. You have the cream leather, you have the black leather. I mean, this is just a beautiful booty. At $100, I mean, you're saving almost $90 getting it during the sale. I would highly recommend picking this up if you are in need of a really nice pair of 
booties for this fall and winter. Another pair of booties are these Steve Madden ones. I think that these are really beautiful. The cutouts on the ankle is such a huge trend. I saw it a lot last year, so it's one that's definitely falling over into this season. This one, you get two suede options, and I think the neutral snake print is so pretty. I like the fact, too, that this is a chunky heel. These are gonna be super comfortable to walk in all day. I like also that this comes with a zipper in the back, so it's super easy to get on and off. You don't have to worry about that. This is a really pretty boot, and again, this is $10 less than the previous booty, so I think that this one might be a hot seller also. Another hot seller will be these Vince Camuto booties. These are really pretty. They have the same cutout ankles as the last boots that we saw, not as intense. I do like that the sole of the shoe is a little bit thicker. To me, it kind of adds that element of the chunky booty that you'll be seeing more of in this video. But this one, I mean, it comes in so many colorways. And then I also, I love these colorways that have the embossing of like the animal print. It's almost like an alligator print. Comes in a, a taupe and I believe a black. Yeah, I mean, just beautiful shades. It's super elevated, just a sexy, sleek booty. Another one that will sell out fast, in my opinion. Next up is this Stevie booty. I love the height of this boot. It is nice because it's not necessarily an ankle booty. It goes up a little bit past that. It's just gorgeous, in my opinion. It also comes in four shades. They're all leather options. You have the beautiful white, you have a green, a rich brown, and then your classic black. This again is that square toe, which is super trendy this year. What I like about this boot is the subtle details of it. It looks like a really simple boot, but with the stitching wrapped around the ankle, I mean, it's just, in my opinion, this is like hot mama boots <laughs> if that was a thing uh yeah I love this and then this is a really cool color this green shade I saw a lot in the coats and jacket video that I did there was a lot of coats that were this beautiful darker green or rich green so I feel that this is a color that's super trendy this year and I'm loving all these brown boot options because I feel last year I couldn't really find a deep rich brown so I love that that comes in this boot as well. Looks super comfortable also. So we shall see. This one is another gorgeous one and one that's on my wish list. Now, shade wise, that's a toughie. I would probably say just the classic black for me, but we'll see if I end up getting them or not. Since we're on the topic of black boots, we're gonna go straight into this pair here. This is a Chelsea booty. And I just love the simplicity of the design of this booty. It's super sexy, super chic. I really like the cap toe on this. It does have a little bit of height in the heel, but nothing crazy. And if you guys remember the tip that I gave you in the coats and jacket video, I spoke about looking at these items from your PC, your laptop, so that way you can look at the videos that is on the side with all the picture gallery so you can see the Nordstrom Sales Associates show you a video of the item that you're looking at. In this one, they did mention that the sizing is a little unique. So to look at the sizing chart when you're ordering your boots. So I thought that that was a really good little tip to throw in there. So that way you guys can make sure that you're getting the right size. Let's go ahead and dive into a pair of shoes that are very affordable. These ones here by BP, these Western Mules. Again, that really beautiful, sexy, sleek shape to them. And you do get three color options to choose from. These are a bargain, $40. You guys, I mean, these boots look easily over $100. If you're on a budget, these are the shoes to go with. I mean, you can pick up two pairs of these for less than one pair of one of the earlier booties that I showed you. So you can get some variety. I would recommend picking up the taupe pair and the black um, just to have two options for, you know, your everyday shoes to wear during fall and winter. Yeah, I mean, this is just a really beautiful, simple, affordable pair of shoes 
that look really pretty to me. I love the brand 42 Gold. If you guys have not searched them on Nordstrom, I highly recommend just like typing in the search engine and type in that brand for shoes. I have quite a few pair. Actually, I think I have like two or three pair of their heeled sandals and I love them. So I'm very intrigued about these booties. And again, you have so many color options and that's the one thing that I really like about this year is you have so many colors to choose from when it comes to the shoes. So you do have that nice variety there. With this, I like that this is your Chelsea boot, but it is totally elevated and definitely more dressy um, as far as the really skinny heel, but the heel is a very low height. So if we look at the dimensions here, it's three and a quarter inch heel. So super manageable. Okay, I wanna mix things up a little bit. I wanted to throw in these Calvin Klein slingback pumps. How gorgeous are these? They're super simple, super sleek, timeless. I think for me, the biggest thing when I think about buying shoes or a jacket or you know a bag, any accessories to my clothes is things that are gonna be timeless. I especially love this in the denim. Now, in my opinion, I think denim could be considered a neutral. It's like your leopard print or cheetah print, you know, some people consider that a neutral because it is timeless. Now I plan to pick up the denim version of these slingback shoes. I plan to wear these with any wash of denim, um, shorts or pants, skinny jeans. I think that that's the beauty of a denim pair of shoes is like, or even a denim bag is you can mix and match it with other denim items and really create a beautiful monochromatic look. So I'm excited about that. It does also come in a black leather and a sort of like cognac color, which is really pretty. So if you need a sleek pair of shoes just for every day for the office, just a pair of shoes that are your go-to to dress up, these look really nice. And the heel height is really good too. It's not even three inches. So it's gonna be a really good heel to actually wear all day and walk around in. Speaking of workwear shoes, these pumps look so gorgeous. They're the Danica Pointed Toe Pump, again from Calvin Klein. These are even smaller. They're only a two inch heel. So extremely comfortable um, to wear all day. These come in five different colorways, which, ooh, that's gonna make it really hard to choose which one. Me personally, I plan on picking up the black leather, um, I don't have a pointed toe black shoe. So I looked at my wardrobe and I said, you know, I actually really need to get a pair that I could wear and feel good in all day. And these look like it for me. Okay, I've been talking shoes for a while. So I'm gonna cut this video and make it a two part. So I'm gonna end the video on a very high note with these beautiful pointed toe booty shoes from Schutz, or is it Schutz? I don't know how to say the brand exactly. Either way, gorgeous shoe. It comes in a patent black, and then you also have that wonderful eggshell color, just like the first boot that I talked about. I love this shade. It's a really beautiful yellow cream kind of shade, so it could go with tons of neutrals. Now, what I like about this boot is how sleek it is. The patent leather on it, it doesn't look cheap. It looks elevated. It looks sexy. It looks fun. And I like the heel on this, how it sort of caves in a little bit and it's not directly on the back of the boot. To me, that adds an element of design and, and it would also kind of make it a little bit easier to walk in too. So love that three inch heel. And then just looking at the design of it, I like that it does have a little bit of interest with the middle panel of the boot being a slightly off color than the rest of the boot. So it definitely adds another element of design. Don't forget to come back for part two. I have some more shoes that I wanna go over with you guys that are on the preview that I think will be hot sellers this year and ones that you could add to your wardrobe. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.